Little Tom's heartbroken mother Diane, seen here holding his little wellies and favourite cuddly toy, was discharged from hospital following the crash and arrived at the church today to say goodbye to her only son. Mourners from across the country were on hand to lend their support to the grieving families. President of Ireland Michael D. Higgins was also in attendance. Three-year-old Tom Riley died alongside his grandparents Thomas and Bridget Riley when the car they were travelling in crashed outside Cashel last week. Young Tom's father, Tom Senior, was driving the car at the time. He remains in hospital. Prayers were also said for members of the emergency services who attended the horrific crash. Father Ender Brady said statistics and numbers are produced every so often. And among these figures given are the number of people who die in our roads. But Thomas, Bridget and little Tom were more than numbers, said Father Brady. The one thing is I don't want to minimalise the statistics either, but the reality is we hear numbers and when it's not on your own doorstep, you just take it as numbers, you forget that there's people behind the, the numbers. And, you know, not only here in Tipperary over the last weeks and days, um, throughout the county, so many people lose relatives on the road and I think we have to remember these are all people, these are all precious members of families and you know our thoughts and prayers are definitely with them at this time. The sorrow being felt across Cashel and beyond is indescribable. People are finding it hard to come to terms with the loss of three lives. Thomas and Bridget Riley were the parents of ten children, the youngest just eight years of age. Although the sun was shining today, clouds of grief hang over Cashel and beyond. Thomas and Bridget and their grandson Tom were all buried together in the cemetery close to the homes where they once lived and loved life with their families.